What's going on YouTube? Giosman right here. So in today's video we have more great news to discuss about the A12 jailbreak for iOS 12.4 and lower by pound to own, but also some bad news coming from Apple. So I'm gonna start with the bad news. They released the iOS 12.4.1 just a few hours ago. So as you can see is this one in here, iOS 12.4.1, 16G102, and this is basically iOS 12.4.1, which is only designed to patch one single vulnerability, and that is the kernel vulnerability by Ned Williamson used in the exploits that are used for 12.4 and of course 12.2 and so on in the uncovered jailbreak. So if you want to jailbreak you should definitely stay on iOS 12.4 or lower because iOS 12.4.1 does indeed patch the vulnerability this time. Now the vulnerability should have been patched in iOS 12.4 but apparently Apple did some mistakes and of course they had to release 12.4.1 which allowed us to actually jailbreak 12.4. Now Pound Own confirmed just a few hours ago, quote, I can confirm the exploit was patched in iOS 12.4.1, stay on iOS 12.4, and I would definitely expect the iOS 12.4 to be unsigned soon, so definitely save your blobs as fast as possible. But Town to Own also made a lot of progress towards the A12 jailbreak for iOS 12.4, 12.2, 12.4 and so on. He posted, quote, I have so far completed about 35% of the work needed for CDA installation on A12 and A12X. I'm still actively working on it. And after that, of course, he posted this, quote, I have just gotten the CDA installation process mostly working. I will now clean up my substitute server logic. It is incredibly complicated and it's important to make Make sure that it's rock solid to preserve system stability. And then of course he posted this, quote, I'm still working on improving and polishing the substitute server logic for A12 and A12X devices. The majority of the work has been completed, but it needs some polishing and fixes before the release. So basically for the A12 people is definitely happening. You will definitely have a jailbreak with tweaks. CDA installation has already been achieved, even though it still needs a little bit of cleanup and polishing, but it works without the PAC bypass, which is actually quite good. For those of you who are not aware, the A12 devices are basically the iPhone XS, XS Max and XR, and the A12X are all the iPads that have an A12X chip, so basically the newest ones. So yeah, if you want to jailbreak your device on A12 or A12X chip, you definitely should wait on iOS 12.4. Do not update iOS 12.4.1. The only difference that the iOS 12.4.1 has is basically the kernel bug used in Uncover patched in 12.4.1. So definitely definitely stay on 12.4 as Pound Own recommends in here. And by the way, I would definitely recommend it to save your blobs using either TSS Saver or TSS Checker because the iOS 12.4 will definitely be unsigned soon. Now, for those of you who are waiting for the A12 jailbreak, this is definitely coming. Both the CD installation and the substitute which are required for the jailbreak are mostly done, which is definitely nice, and even though it still needs more improvements, we're getting there. Thank you for watching, I am Geosnow, and till the next time, Peace out.